How's it going everybody? It's the man, the myth, the legend, Quad MFT here, and in today's video I'll be talking about something that recently I've been wanting to talk about quite a bit, and a lot of people have been talking about it also. It's Call of Duty Ghost, or supposedly the next Call of Duty. Now we're talking about the next Call of Duty definitely a little bit too early in my opinion in the lifetime of Black Ops 2. Regularly we like to talk about this near May and June and July and sort of the summer times, but recently we've been talking about it near February and March, which is really crazy. It shows that a lot of people aren't really enjoying Black Ops 2 all that much even though me personally I am enjoying Black Ops 2 quite a bit I love this game and the gameplay that you guys are looking at is some sharpshooter on the Xbox 360 I personally love sharpshooter sharpshooter is probably what keeps this game alive for me overall in Black Ops 2 but really guys what I wanted to say and tell you guys is the next Call of Duty and what I think I want the next Call of Duty to be so about this time every year is the time I like to brainstorm what I want to see in the next Call of Duty. So what I'd really like to see in the next Call of Duty is the fact that they should make one huge Call of Duty. The best Call of Duty anybody's ever created. Now I'm not saying I came up with this idea. I'm not saying this is the best idea that would bring Call of Duty the creators the most money, the most advertising or anything like that. But I think if all the Call of Duty creators like Activision, Treyarch, and Infinity Ward, I feel like if they could get along, they could create some crazy good game. If they all worked together and did what each other wanted and brought back the good things like what I mean by brought back the good things and bring back the best things from Call of Duty 4 bring them back from Modern Warfare 2 World at War Black Ops 1 Modern Warfare 3 and even Black Ops 2 so if I could only bring back a select few things back for Modern Warfare 2, Call of Duty 4, World at War, Black Ops 1, or something like that, why I would choose is what I would choose is definitely maps. Now why I would choose maps over a perk, over an attachment, or a gun, or select different sort of things, why I would choose a map is because every time I go back and I play a previous Call of Duty, I like that feeling. I like that feeling when I'm like, ah, I know every single corner of this map, it kind of feels like home, it kind of feels like that old neighborhood that I grew up in and stuff like that. Why it feels like that is because I remember in Back in Black Black Ops 1 back in Modern Warfare 2, I did not know what a win-loss ratio was, I didn't know what a score per minute was, I didn't know if I was doing good, I didn't know if I had good internet connection by a 4 bar or a 3 bar, all I knew is every time I got on a 4 bar, I would do really well, that's all I knew guys, I didn't know what a kill-death ratio was, the whole time for me it was just about having fun, it was just about having a good time, and that's why I'd bring back a few maps, I mean maybe it's just a little bit of nostalgia in me, maybe it's just a little bit of that showing, but I really like the old maps, I really like firing range from Black Ops 1, I I really like Nuketown from Black Ops 1, but tell me down in the comment section below if you guys could bring back three maps, what maps would you bring, and tell me also if you guys could bring back one gun from any Call of Duty, you can't choose more than one gun, it can't be one in Black Ops 1, one in Modern Warfare 2, it has to be one through Call of Duty 4 and Black Ops 2, if you could bring back one in the next Call of Duty, which if I haven't said this already in this commentary, it's been pretty much confirmed, I mean it hasn't been confirmed by like Infinity Ward or the owners of Call of Duty or anything, but it's pretty much said that the next Call of Duty is going to be called Call of Duty Ghosts. So again, tell me down in the comment section below if you guys could bring back one gun from all the old Call of Duties and three maps from all the old Call of Duties. So if I could only bring back one gun from any Call of Duty, and I know I'm going to get a ton of hate on this just because it's a really overpowered gun, it would definitely be the FAMAS back from Black Ops 1. Now why I would choose to bring back the FAMAS back from Black Ops 1 is mainly because I love that gun so much. I believe I had over 20,000 some odd kills with just the FAMAS, not overall in Black Ops 1, but just the FAMAS over 20 some odd thousand kills which in my opinion that's a lot of kills with just the FAMAS I really like the FAMAS a lot of my friends really enjoyed using it too I had a few friends that really didn't like it at all it was like practically their least favorite gun in Black Ops 1 which I don't really understand I mean occasionally I'll get that feeling where I'll pick up a gun and I'll just do terrible with it and then I'll probably use it never again just mainly because I, I had one bad game with it and I think it's the gun that's cursing when really it's the connection or it's my playstyle that I did that game but again guys tell me the one gun if you could bring back any gun into the next Call of Duty, which gun would it be? Thanks guys for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Remember to give me a huge thumbs up down below. Those thumbs up always help me out a ton. If we could try and hit 140 likes, the big 140 on this video, that would be really cool. Remember to add this video to your favorites if it was one of your favorite videos. And if you guys want to play Black Ops 2 with me or play a few games with me or maybe even just interact with me, make sure to go and follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Both those links will be in the description below. Also go and like my Facebook page. That's another great place to interact with me. It's been QuadMFT. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Video. I love every single one of you guys and I'll see you next time.